Hello everyone, this is Hakan from Web News Team and welcome back to our channel. So today in this video we are going to talk about one of our most popular add-ons which is Elementor Single. Well, uh, as the name suggests, using this add-on you can easily create your custom event template for your single event page using the Elementor page with love. So don't go anywhere to see how to do it. After installing and activating the add-on, you must head to Elementor settings to enable the event single build option um, for post types. Afterwards, we'll navigate to ME Calendar menu and click on the newly added single builder menu option. Here, you can see the previous templates that I've created, but we're gonna create a new one, so hit add new. Let's name it single page and click on edit with Elementor. In the Elementor Builder environment, we have a section called Mac Single Builder. It includes all the widgets needed to design an event page. Let's create a two column page on Elementor. And drag event title and define the tag for it. We have the style tab to change the phone size, phone type and color. Let's add content widget as well and set the alignment for it. Next, we'll uh, add some event information by adding the time widget. The typography options for this widget are amazing. The smallest detail, including icon size and style, can be modified. Another must is the even cost, which offers similar typography options. Let's change the background color for the cost to highlight it. I'll add it to the time widget as well. There are a lot of widgets here, as you can see, but for this demonstration, I just want to use widgets that are essential. So, let's add the register button and change the border radius to give it less of an edge. Let's also add a booking model to our event page. You have the option to show price labels as well. The great thing about it is that it can customize each section in terms of its design. For example, I can change the booking uh, button to both a different font and color. But, uh, all good, but, but your event is not quite complete with an image or a gallery to really promote it. The image box can be specified. If the image resolution is low, I can set an exact resolution to upscale the image. The image is much clearer now. We'll add a small radius around this widget as well. Once we've done this, we can hit the publish button to save our template.
Afterwards, we need to head to our settings, single event, and change the single event style to element to single builder. You also need to choose the default build out of the template we just created. The first option is for when you open an event page, and the second option is for model view. Finally, hit save changes on the top right, and let's head to our event page. Let's refresh our old event page, and once I reload it, uh, my newly created uh, template takes effect. It is very easy, huh? Don't you agree? Your customization options are endless. You can change the space between the columns or anything that's loaded in Element. I think we'll need a category widget as well. Now, for the organizer widget, which, just like the booking module, has multiple sections that can each be customized. All in all, this level of customization can be found across all even page widgets. Another major benefit is being able to design the responsive view while on Elementor for different um, devices. We can live and change which widgets are moved and on a mobile device, so the most important piece of information is shown. This this was just a glimpse into what you can achieve with this app. Let's uh, hit publish again and reload our event page to see how it looks now. So, even if our newer single event page styles are not to your liking, you will have the option to create your very own custom design. Thank you very much for staying with me until the end of the video, and don't forget to like the video if you liked it, and also ring that notification bell not to miss on any of our upcoming videos in the future. We are definitely looking to your uh, looking into your you know, feedback and also the ideas you have regarding your future videos. Uh, my name is Caliber, so please do write them down below in the comment section so we can have new ideas for your questions about my name is Caliber. And also, we could improve all videos using your feedback. See you in the next video.